Wizard Hosue has succeeded in contacting a neighboring kingdom of West Chapel and their leader King Loko, the group's long lost childhood friend. King Loko will come to meet the King Jake and form an alliance and devise a trade agreement and means of providing help in the Kingdom of Berg situation. Negotiations are underway between King Jake and King Loco. Mira, hermano, what is in it for me? I have enough jewels to keep my kingdom financially stable for generations to come. So why? Why should I sacrifice all that for the sake of your kingdom? Once Berg gets back on its feet, I'm willing to provide your kingdom with a portion of our profits. In the meantime, our strong military will give ample security to your kingdom. The mountains have given me enough natural security. I do not need your men. Negotiation plans fall through between the two kings. King Local abducts the Queen Taylor late into the night. King Jake is distraught and must manage to work out a way to return the Queen, who he loves so dearly, and must do so in a manner that deals with this disturbance before it escalates into an all-out war. Surely, if the people of Berg learn that their beloved Queen Taylor is kidnapped, the rioting will begin again. He gathers his friends once again to devise a plan for the returning of the Queen. I want my Queen returned safely to my throne. Josue, prepare us for our journey with adequate resources. Baroness Knight, you must navigate and find the best route to West Chapel. My father once took me through the tunnels of the Misty Mountains. I believe this is the best way for us to get back to West Chapel without being seen. We must travel in a small party to make it out alive. Right, Richard? Uh, yes, uh, that's right. I have spoken with the centaurs in the forest. They inform me that the pathway is clear to the mountains. I will sacrifice all the gold in this entire kingdom to get our people's queen back to Berg. Next week, see if the team is able to rescue the queen, or if they must say, hasta la vista, baby.